All right, guys, this is JR with Extreme Outfitters. Today, we're going to be going over Redline's new site, the Torch. This thing is pretty sweet, man. We've been, uh, we got a sneak peek at this a couple weeks ago, and man, we were really impressed with it. So, I'm going to kind of go over some of the features and everything with it and uh, let you guys know well, my impression of it. So, I personally want to get one. That's just me. So, anyway, getting into it. So there's two different options that you have. You have either the dovetail mount or you have a direct mount, which will directly mount to your riser. The nice thing with this is you have all of your adjustability. So first, second, third, all of that is adjustable and it actually has really nice markings that can make it a little bit easier to see everything on there. Um, when, you're, when you're going for your windage adjustment, you actually have your lock screw right here. And it's actually, you got that little clicks. I don't know if you can hear it or not, but it's really fine clicks. It's really nicely made with that. You also have the option to take your scope mount completely off. All you have to do is loosen this screw right here in the bottom and you can take that bar completely off. So if you want to store it or also with that nifty feature where you have that built-in light kit, if you want to recharge it, it makes it super easier. So you have nice little indentions here on the back side, so you can actually see where it sits and you got to remember where you put it back in at. Overall, it's really cool features with that. One of the coolest features I think that came on this um, on the site is the fact that you can actually run two different sight tapes on it if you want to. You have the option to run that metal sight tape, which you got a whole bunch of metal sight tapes right in here, or you can run a stick on vinyl tape, which will go right on your wheel. So basically you can set this up for two different arrow configurations and it'll, it'll be awesome for that. Um, another nice feature with this is it's a two pin and they're both stacked vertically. So your top pin is actually a 19 thousandths, and then your bottom pin is a 10 thousandths, which is a really cool feature of that, especially if you're going to end up taking longer shots, or if you have like uh, astigmatism like I've got a little bit, it'll help with that cloud burst, and it's not going to burst as much in your face. It's a really cool feature with that. It's a very, uh, very well machine, I think, for your adjustability for your elevation. It's very solid. It's not, there's not a lot of slop in it, I don't think. And you have the option to even add these two little thumb screws on here if you want to run that instead of just running on the wheel. So all in all, it's really cool features on there. Um, I'm really stoked about it. And for the price point and everything, it's really affordable. So uh, real quick, I'll go over some kind of features of it. They did put a lot of it on the back, which is really nice. Um, another cool thing is you get a couple different color levels if you want to run a different color level too. So it's really cool that. Uh, the battery life, they say, runs for about eight hours. So if you just leave it on, It'll run for about eight hours. There are three different brightness settings on it. So you can have, once you turn around, you have the brightest one. Let's see, I don't know if this one's charged or not. That one's dead. Let's see this guy. Yeah, so here you go. So there's that bright setting. Once you put it on, it's gonna be in that brightest setting. You hit the button again, it'll dim it down a little bit more. And then there's your third setting, and then your last. Oh, there's four. Ah, I was wrong. So there's that fourth setting, that's the lowest setting. And then you hit it one more time and then it turns off. So the only thing with that is you have to make sure you turn it off, otherwise it will just continuously run um, and drain that battery. But the nice thing with that is, you know, it is micro USB charged. So you can plug it into a computer or if you have a plug in your vehicle or even um, a wall outlet, it's got that micro USB on there. They say it takes about an hour to charge it, fully charged. So, I mean, we haven't tested that yet, but we'll have to play around with it. Um, so for the dovetail mount, it is saying that this weighs 13.125 ounces. And then on the direct mount, got that one right here. That one is 11.11 ounces. So this one is a little bit lighter. It really can't tell that difference. I mean, I guess you kind of can, but it's not a drastic difference on there. Other than that, that's the cool features with that. If you guys got any questions, hit us up at extremeoutfitters.com. Don't forget to like and subscribe. We'll catch you all later on.